Today we're going to create a new uh, swap file uh, in my VPS, which is Linux machine, uh, run on top of uh, cloud infrastructure such as Google Cloud, Amazon Cloud, or DigitalOcean, or Linode, or any of them. Okay, so after we SSH SSHed into your machine, we need to create a file which will be a swap file because we cannot use a swap partition as in a real machine we need to create a swap file so i'm going to switch to var directory but you can use any other place such as a root directory you cannot create a swap file in this directory without elevating your privileges you need to become a super user so I turned into super user mode by typing sudo su then I use touch swap. We need to set the right file permissions in order to keep this file secure and protected. To do that we need to type chmod command and set uh, 600 file permissions. Then we need to write uh, the size we need for this swap. So we're gonna use DD utility and I'm gonna use uh, 512 megabytes of swap in this case because as you see my RAM uh, is around that and so you use block size for one megabytes and count is 512 so it, it's gonna take a while maybe several seconds, maybe one minute, you'll see. And after that, you'll see the exact time which it took. And you also got, uh, yeah, you also got a, an average speed, or an, et cetera. And then we need to create a special partition type for a swap file. You cannot just use it as it is. Uh, so if you try to use it, swap on and then type the file name. Uh, sorry, <laughs> misspelled. And then you cannot use it, and uh, because uh, it's not considered a swap file. So you need to make swap. And uh, to do it, just type mkswap and then file name. And after that, you can use your swap file to make it permanent after each reboot need to do an extra step okay let's just type swap on and swap okay we don't need we ain't need that UID uh, yeah but anyway we need to create an entry in our fstep file space swap space swap space defaults and then two zeros okay and then to append you have to use uh, greater symbol twice and then etc fs tab. You also can just edit etc fs tab by writing this line. Thanks for watching. That is about creating a swap file into your VPS. I hope you found it useful and thanks for watching. Goodbye.